Hi, I'm Erica Courier. I'm a commercial fisherman from Alaska, and for years I've shared my secrets on how to cook seafood. People often ask me how to avoid overcooking seafood. Today I'm going to show you a couple easy steps to determine doneness based on color. Coho is one of the five types of salmon, and it's a really succulent, great tasting fish when prepared right. You want to remember to brush olive oil on the front and the back side to avoid sticking. Season it lightly with salt and pepper. I'm going to cook the salmon about four inches from the heat. As it cooks, it's going to move from darker pink, the color it is now, to lighter pink, opaque. When the core just changes to opaque, you want to pull it out. I like cod because it's a really quick and easy meal, and if you're in a hurry, cod is a great choice. It cooks really fast and has a wonderful, mild flavor. First, we're going to preheat our pan. Pat the fillets dry. We're going to take some peanut oil and brush oil on both sides. We're going to cook these fillets just a few minutes on each side. You want to wait until the side is golden brown before we flip it. You want to keep a close eye once your fish starts cooking. For a large fillet, I start checking it after about 10 minutes. We're going to take just the point of the knife and stick it in the thickest part of the fillet. We still have a little ways to go. It's not quite opaque, it's still translucent. Stick it back in for a couple minutes, for just a couple minutes. Cod tends to cook a lot faster than other types of fish. You want to turn the fillets when they're just golden brown and then season them with a little bit of peanut oil and some garlic. Now that we've flipped them, it's a good idea to cover your fillets. Some people prefer the thermometer method, and when you use this method, you want to stick the thermometer in the thickest part of the fillet, but be sure not to be touching the skillet. When it reaches 135, 140, pull the fish off the heat. Now let's take a look at the fillets. Again, we want to cook these fillets till the core just changes to opaque. And you see how the color is changing from the edges to the center. The core is now opaque. Pull it off the heat and the fish will continue cooking off the heat source. We're going to go ahead and check the salmon. Again, we're going to stick the very tip of the knife in the thickest part and it looks like it's just barely opaque. So our salmon's done. We're going to pull it out. To ensure that you cook great seafood every time, start with a quality ingredient like wild Alaskan seafood. Remember that seafood cooks faster than other meats and watch the color. As soon as it changes, pull it off the heat and you will have perfect seafood every time you cook.